Antler hunting is a big adventure here in Montana, and people and horses are all ready to go. I'm out here in the Sun River Wildlife Management Area, and we're getting ready for the gates to be open on opening day. People from all over Montana gather together for the largest Easter egg hunt around. But it's not eggs they're hunting, it's elk antlers. It's quite an event. <laughs> it's something unique to the West, I'd say. Um, reminds one a little bit of the land rush in the old days. I'd imagine it'd be like that when all those horses come pouring through that gate at noon. But uh, basically, the elk have been wintering up here all winter, and the bulls have dropped their horns, and the people are here to hunt some sheds. This, this is one of our favorite days of the year. We're, we're, gonna, we're kind of first here at the gate, and we're going to go down through those other two other gates and, and get across the meadow as fast as we can to get to some horns. The road is packed with vehicles, horses, and people for over a mile. Some have camped out for days to be one of the first through the gates in search of the lucrative elk antlers. We stayed in, uh, yeah, I was in a tent and she was in her truck. Down the road. Yep. I'm here for the views as more than the antlers. Yeah. But, and to see the area. But, yeah. you know, it's an excuse to be here, right? And the people <laughs> we've met, too. Yeah. 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 The fence line were covered with people scanning the horizon, looking for those hidden gems. Minutes away from high noon, the horses and people were ready to go. The gun went off, and they were on the hunt. The horses took off, and the vehicles started to pour in. After many hours scouring the mountainside, the prizes started to make their way down. You could see how proud these folks were in finding their antlers. From young to old, they were grinning from ear to ear. The kid at heart in all of them was exciting to see. I'm proud to say I'm from Montana, and hopefully next year I will find an antler as well. From Sun River Wildlife Management Area, I'm Paul Sanchez for MTN News.